Hey Flosstube, Ashley here, Buggy Stitcher on YouTube, Shleetham underscore Buggy Stitcher on Instagram, coming to you guys with another unboxing. This one is from GBFKE. I will leave all of their information in the description box down below, along with a coupon code in case you're interested. Uh, we have a cross stitch pattern and a diamond painting. I will leave the diamond painting for the end of the video in case you are not interested in seeing that. So let's go ahead and just dive right in. <clears throat> first things first, we have our cross stitch. And we have this stunner. So um, ever since I did the fairy for my mom, uh, she's seen this and she's wanted this. Uh, we've been on the search for it. It keeps going um, on and off the market. So I finally found her on GBFKE and I am gonna be gifting this to her. It is a 40 by 70 and it kind of matches the fairy that I stitched for her. So she's pretty excited and I'm excited as well. Um, so let's go ahead and see. Um, it did come with a little stitching kit. We have a pom-pom with some gold tip needles, a thimble and a needle threader. This is on poster paper, nice and shiny. Um, the symbols on the pattern seem to look okay. And it looks like it has 50 colors. Wow, um, that's, that's a lot of colors for, for this. Uh, we also have instructions over here. And again, here's the pattern. All right, this um, project is completely surged. It has some small margins, but because it's surged, I'm okay with that. So here is the canvas very long just like my mom's fairy that she's working on for the fairy cell um, again it's got 50 colors and i'm just going to quickly look and see what symbols they have and see if they are going to pose a problem they have a red dot and an orange dot but i can easily tell the difference in the stamping They do have a light pink, a dark pink, and a red square, but again, I can also see the difference between those two as well. Um, stamping looks really good. I don't see any problems with the stamping at all. Yeah, it looks really nice. Let me uh, show you a close-up really fast. Pretty good stamping. Um, very clear symbols, um, very clear key. All looks really good. So I did come out with a couple extra colors. We have two 413s and an extra, I think this is 500. And then two 310s of black. And then again, this is 50 colors. Ooh, and pretty colors too. So I'll show you the one by itself. We got some teals and grays and a little light purple over here. And then, not very many colors on here. I mean like a lot of the colors that they give. So I'm, I'm a little surprised about that. <laughs> Must have kind of the same colors. But bulk color. There we go, there's the colors. And let me show the um, pattern one more time. There we go. There we go. It's so long. All right, y'all, that is it. So thank you so much. Oh wait, no, we have our diamond painting. Oh, I forgot about the diamond painting. Jeez Louise, silly me. You wanna see it? Stay over there. It's a pretty cup. Shh, shh, shh. All right, here is the diamond painting. It's a beautiful porcelain teacup with a little castle in the back. I absolutely love this pattern. If only I can find it as a cross stitch. Um, but this is a round pattern. It's got sparkly canvas and it's got 28 colors. And I love it. Love, 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 love it. So pretty, it just reminds me of a fairy tale. It's adorable. All right, 26 colors. Let me see if I can get these things open. Sorry, crinkling. Let 
All right, and we have the little um, bat, like pouches. I'm not really a big fan of the pouches because you have to open them and there's no way to close them afterwards, but that's okay. Very shiny. And here's the big one. So we have all kinds of colors. And um, this pattern is a 30 by 40. And there we go. Okay, now, <laughs> that is everything. So thank you all so much for joining me. I really appreciate every single one of you. I hope you all have a fabulous day. Stay safe, stay warm, <laughs> and take care. Bye.